welcome back um, in this video I'm not going to show you uh, coding so we are doing coding uh, a lot that's why I would like to show you um, before we do the front end part like this uh, I would like to show how to host the entire website as a backend uh, I mean API and also the react um, the front end with the using Farcel. this is really nice one um, I, I have been uh, using this one for multiple projects um, so I, I, I use um, this I host this uh, real note uh, short app so right now as you see um, this is a domain that is generated by the varset.app and my my repo name so this is um, automatically uh, hosted using github repo if you have a uh, github repo so you can host you can create the varset account by using GitHub. So I will show you later at the end of this series how to uh, host your um, entire website using the far cell. Um, so yeah, so I, I will show um, I will show also demonstra uh, demonstration uh, the use how we can uh, use the UI using the Varsel, uh, Varsel Ho, everything, the function, everything as I show in the demo webs, uh, demo demo video. So it's the same. So I haven't shown you a responsive. So here you can see uh, it's a responsive. According to the site and dimension, um, the image and the, 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 the background is scaled by the dimension. So as you see, uh, for the last screen, um, the card is arranged by the full and if I make like this now it is um, 837 pixel into 1143 so now for the small screen I 72 under 725 pixel is only one card if it is more smaller the image is like this so it's it's nice to be a responsive website so I will show you uh, by using um, okay so yeah like this site so if I act if I go in the product DDA as you see it's already responsive uh, to cart and in our cart uh, we have free our address here which you people and we click project so as you see the paper uh, has been already uh, integrated uh, in our fossil was a hosting site so if I click a uh, people now this is my testing account paper testing account and as you see the, the total amount and then I click purchase and we are redirect back here so when I go to my profile profile page you will see order list here so everything is responsive and nice so everything work as i show in look at uh, look at look at environment the same everything is working fine in our far cell hosting site as well if i refresh the bay is stay here um sometime uh if you don't confit probably you will have a problem when you refresh the page like 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 this domain slash the, the 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 pages so if you refresh you will get error so i will also tell um how to solve these kinds of problems and everything so this is uh free okay this is free because as a hobby um user can make requests i think um thirty thousand yeah if i'm not wrong so you can find so if it, you want you have more user you can upgrade to pro and you can upgrade to enter enterprise level so this is hobby and it's free you can host your website free serverless you don't need to touch to configure server or something like this this very nice feature uh, when you change something in local and push to github repo it's automatically uh, deploying so right now uh, for me it's um, deploying like 70 seconds ago if I go back to my repo here so this is a header header we have like Android shop and so Android shop I will say update so I will text git at git commit dash m 
update HUD header. Okay, if I save and then give push. If I push, as soon as I push, uh, it will it will build here. Okay, so as you see, it's now coined it, and the 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 current branch website is stay working. So there is no downtime. That's good feature of ourselves. So when you go to that uh, building now, it's building process, environment and production and duration. As you see, everything is um, doing at the back by itself automatically. After it's been um, built, you can refresh here and it will be updated automatically. That's a nice one. So I think, yeah, it's, it's finished. So as you see, uh, Android show update when you refresh here, the same. Okay, cool. So at the end of this series, when we make the UI, uh, when we finish our UI, I will show you also uh, deployment process using Farcell. So I just want to let you know that we will do everything like a full-step developer. So cool, and thank you. I will see you next video.